Hello friends, in this video you can learn about the fingerprint sensor based door lock. In this project, you can see that this is the door lock and this is the fingerprint sensor. When we put our finger on the fingerprint sensor, then our door lock becomes open because this fingerprint is a valid fingerprint. And if I put the invalid fingerprint, then the buzzer activate and we know that our fingerprint sensor did not match a fingerprint. But when I touch my forefinger again, then the door lock becomes open. So you can understand it that this project is just work like this. So friends, for making this project, we need some robotic component, just like Arduino Uno, HA05 Bluetooth module, R307 fingerprint sensor module, 12 volt or 5 volt buzzer, CD driver. If you use CD driver to make in your door lock, then you also need motor driver module to rotate motor left and right. some jumper wires and a 12 volt power supply. Friends, before making this project, you need to know something about this R307 fingerprint sensor module. In this R307 fingerprint sensor module, you can save or delete till 127 numbers as you can see in the app means you can only save 127 fingerprints in this fingerprint sensor module. Let's see that how this setup works. Friends, this is the back part of the project. This is the CD driver which is close and open by using this motor driver module and this is the motor this motor driver module is given to the output of Arduino Uno here and negative and positive also now for fingerprint sensor the TX and RX and negative and positive given to this Arduino Uno and the Bluetooth module connect to this Arduino Uno for giving the command of enrollment and deletion of any fingerprint. And this is the buzzer which got activate when a unknown fingerprint touches. For whole project we need to give the power to this Arduino Uno by 12 volt. Now let's see the circuit diagram. Friends, you can take the screenshot of the circuit diagram by pausing the video. Friends, this door lock open time is adjusted in the code. So let's see the code now. Friends, this is the whole code to program the fingerprint sensor module. First of all, you need to download this library, add a fruit fingerprint.h. 
Then you need to define your output pins. Then in word setup, write the pins output and this is the whole process of taking the fingerprint from the fingerprint sensor module. Then in word loop, the simple process of get image is running but when Bluetooth application gives command of E and D, then enrollment and deletion takes occur. So, this is the whole program for get fingerprint from the fingerprint sensor module. Till this. And then, for void enroll means a new fingerprint to add. This is the whole program to add new fingerprint. And then in void del here, this is the whole program to delete the fingerprint from any ID number. Friends, if you face some problem in understanding the code, then you can also go on this file option and then open the example of this Adafruit fingerprint sensor library. Here, here you can see all code which I merge in this code. Then easily upload this code in your Arduino Uno and do your connection safely so that your project looks better. So friends, in previous clip, as you can see that from my thumb, the door lock is not opened, which means our thumb is not added in this fingerprint sensor. So now, for adding a new fingerprint, we do not need to upload again a code we just need this application this one to delete the fingerprint or to add a new fingerprint so let's see that how we add a new fingerprint to our fingerprint sensor first of all we need to touch this new fingerprint option then as you can see the serial print ready to enroll a fingerprint. So now we need to send a number. A number is an ID on which our fingerprint is saved. Now our thumb is also added in our fingerprint sensor by using this application if you want this application then you can whatsapp us the whatsapp number is given in description box friends in this application you can see the serial monitor of Arduino Uno and also delete any fingerprint of any ID So now let's check with our thumb also that is it added or not. So now the door lock is also open from our thumb which means the thumb is also added in this R307 fingerprint sensor. Friends if you face problem in making this whole hardware due to these many jumper wires then you can purchase this multi-purpose PCB if you want this PCB then you can whatsapp us the whatsapp number is given in description box
in this PCB you need not to attach the motor driver module this one because there are two relays already attached in this PCB which rotates the motor left and right and also for Bluetooth module and fingerprint sensor you no need to attach jumper wires easily from here you can attach the Bluetooth module and fingerprint sensor and for the buzzer you can easily use any digital pins